Welcome back to Rare Bird Gaming. I'm here with Phoenix. Yo. I'm Johnny Bliss, and we're playing Super Mario World, and we just finished this vanilla fortress. We're finally past Cookie Mountain. And you're gonna take on the castle instead of Butterbridge? What? Beating the fortress unlocked Butterbridge. Oh, I'm probably gonna play Butterbridge because I did. <laughs> you yeah. don't feel ready for a castle? Oh, hell no. You're going to be the first person going into that castle. You've been the first person for all three of the others. Go try Butterbridge. It's fine. <laughs> it's probably going to take us a few tries based off our current track record. Probably. Oh no, you know, uh, didn't do, do, I didn't do so good with Cheese Bridge. I'm not sure if I'll do any better with Butterbridge. Especially because it's an auto scroll. I think I'm lactose intolerant. Okay, 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 okay. I assume that they don't, they just keep going down, right? Uh, I, I, I they honestly, uh, I, they do go back up. Oh, well. Son of a gun. Ah, uh, no. Oh, fuck. Okay. Oh, by the way, this is Butterbridge 1. The, uh, whoa. 1. Oh, boy. Yeah. We will, at the bare minimum, beat castle number 4 this week. I hope so. I'm kind of hoping we make a little bit of progress getting towards castle number five, but... Just because I know I'm going to have some problems, Thank you. Thank you so much. Let's let's do this. Hey, at least this week you haven't had a game over. Yeah, that's that's nice. <laughs> it's super nice. We had like five last week. Oh god, yeah, I know. Like almost one an episode. You gonna try out that castle? Yeah, I'm gonna try it out. See what see what all the fuzz is about it. I don't recall much about this castle. But I have beaten it before. What? Yoshi can't go into castles. Damn it, Yoshi. He's not housebroken. Stay here. He will. Even if you die, you'll still have your Yoshi. <laughs> I almost kissed death right in the face. Twice. <laughs> Fuck the shit. Oh yeah, you want to run as fast as you can, by the way. Because that does... Run into death! That goes all the way down. Run right into death. <coughs> yeah. Should I beat... <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> yes, I want to beat Butterbridge. <coughs> but I'm going to go get a cape, because a cape makes it a lot freaking easier. As the cape typically does. I'm kind of excited to play a, a Zelda game soon. Uh, that will be after we do Katamari. I haven't decided which one yet, though. There's more than one Katamari? No, uh, Zelda. Uh, I think we should do chronological order. In what way? 
I have no idea. Because that's kind of like saying watching Star Wars in chronological order. Is it really? <laughs> yeah. Oh. There's the order <clears throat> they came out, or there's the timeline order, and honestly, either way, you're not going to like the first one you play. Because <laughs> that's just how they are. Like, the first one that came out is actually kind of dull unless you're already a fan. And then, really? Yep. And then the first one in order has like an almost hour long freaking you have to play through non-skippable tutorial. Oh, we could cut that out, can't we? I mean, we can, but it's also story important. Was it really? God, why yeah. did do that? Uh, because Nintendo went through a brief phase of dumbing things down ridiculously for little kids. Oh, goodness. Yeah, so... that That's why. Let's put these trees... Uh, oh, the platforms. Or I'm not even sure what they are. Mushrooms? Did, did something? Something's wrong with them. But, yeah, so either way, it would not be a promising Zelda game to start you off with. So I guess probably an order in which they came out would probably be best. But the first, the, the first one is going to be ridiculously boring for you. And then the second one you will not beat. I can guarantee that. You will not beat the second one. I shan't not beat it? Y you won't. No. It won't happen. Why? I'll put it this way. I've been playing Zelda for as long as I can remember and I beat the second one for the first time two years ago. Good lord. Yeah. And I wouldn't call it cheating, but I had to abuse the little safe state feature. Oh. Like crazy, just to beat it, which is not going to be allowed for Let's Plays. Oh. Damn. Let's You'll play it eventually. I'm just stating probably not one to start you off on. <laughs> well, I guess we'll do it in order in which is appropriate. I'm thinking of either starting you on either Link to the Past, which is one of my favorites, or Ocarina of Time, which is another really freaking good one, but it's also an internet favorite, so if you don't like it, we're going to have a whole bunch of mad people. <laughs> Because you basically, you more or less get banned from the internet Ow. if you say you hate Ocarina of Time. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's, that's a lot of pressure. Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, I, I love it. It's a good one. It's just, uh, I don't know what I want to do in this. So I'm going to fly. Seems kind of cheaty, but... Whatever. But, yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that was impressive. Yeah. Quite a level. You just, you just flew right through that one. You're just jealous. I mean, sure, yeah. A after your turn here, I'll be joining you on Ludwig's castle. Hey, nice. Unless you beat it. Yeah, don't count on it. I'm running away. But... And really, as much as I love Breath of the Wild, and I think you'll enjoy the hell out of it as well... I've been uh, really wanting to play it. Just out of curiosity. I kind of don't want you to 
start Zelda with that because it's not a good indicator of what Zelda is. You're gonna lose that cape. I don't think I really need to do it. Eh. Your choice. But, yeah, because Breath of the Wild actually is drastically different from all the other Zelda games. Oh, yeah, it's an open world. It's uh, yeah, but that's not necessarily new to Zelda games. I mean, the first open world Zelda game, in all technicality, was A Link to the Past for the Super Nintendo. And Ocarina of Time after that. And Majora's Mask after that. And all Zelda games oh. up to this point. So that's not necessarily Well, that just shows new. my ignorance. Well, I mean... It, it is in the fact that you can do whatever you want whenever you want, whereas in the other Zelda games, without exploiting, you can't really do that in. I think it's what I meant. I don't know. But it doesn't really uh, matter, I guess. But either way. I mean, you will play it. In the world, blah, blah, blah. Well, you made it past stack. Yeah. Past where you died the first time. Yeah, I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm getting better. I'm okay. speaking. I actually prefer having a cape. In almost every level. Oh, that's that's why. That's the bonus right there. Balls everywhere it makes me nervous. Oh, <laughs> oh, look at you, Mr. Fancy. Cape actually sucks here though, because you can accidentally fly. Oh. Don't, don't, don't. Whew. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> that was intense. Oh, another one of these climby things. What? Oh, well, there's more to it, too. You can actually hit them on the other side, but I'm not going to. Click. Because... Click. doing this for a reason. Oh, what up? Oh. Uh. Regain a few of those lives I lost trying to beat the Resnor Fortress. Ah, uh, I gotcha. Okay, there we go. But yeah, if you uh, press the, that, the punch button, that will hit them on the other side. Oh. Come on, Ludwig. Wow. Physics are mind blowing. <laughs> you were right. We did beat a castle. Well, yeah. 
I think I think I'll take credit for this one. Seeing as that I'm Mario and all. Boom. I, I hit a dicklet. Ludwig von Koopa's days of composing Koopa's symphonies in Castle 4 are over. The Fortress of Illusion lies ahead. Mario must use his brain to solve the puzzle of his, this perplexing forest. Yeah, fuck Luigi, huh? It's so messed up. It's funny. See, the mountain's got a bandage on it now. Yeah. Poor mountain. I feel for it. There you go. Perplexing forest. These. Oh, damn it. Why did I do that? I do that every time. Continue and save. Now. There we go. Okay, start us off in the forest because we got mm -hmm. half an episode left. Oh, really? Yep. Nice. Right. The forest is so weird. Five days are twice as long. Oh, that's right. We started a thing, so Special. we got a... <laughs> ah! Special! Started off! Great! So, this is gonna be... This already looks bad. Fun. This is gonna be fun. Okay, so you cannot kill Wigglers in this game. Okay. You can stun them, apparently. Uh, you don't want to. Really? Yeah, I'll show you in a minute. Okay. Well, not so much for keeping my shell. Yeah, see, if you step on them... Oh. Excuse me. They get angry. And oh. they run much faster. You gotta look, you gotta... You got a dinosaur. But Yoshi can eat him. Okay, let's see if I can time this right. Checkpoint. Kill wigglers with star power, it's two ups. Oh, jeez. Oh, well. Bye, Yoshi. Yeah, screw you, Yoshi. Jeez. I did not mean to do that. <laughs> nice. Nicely done. And you're up. Trees just, trees just move out of the way. Oh, is this an underwater? Nope. No. Not fully. problem is, is I've had years of being able to play. And, I have, s yeah. And I'm used to getting. I think my problem is I just, I just, I hesitate too much. I try to be more particular with my movements for some reason. Yeah, this is not a game to do that in. Now, a little trick about water levels. 
is if you grab something and hold it, ah, you move a lot faster. That's interesting. It's also a lot harder to control, though. <laughs> Hey, we're past halfway. That's that's a good sign. Yeah, unfortunately you can't do anything with the cape while you're actually swimming. <laughs> What's he got? Pencils pencils stuck in his body? It's a sea urchin. There you go. Thick. I'm learning. I could I could have gone, but I, I don't think I want to right now. B -b oh, shit. Take your time. You still got 220 seconds left on this level. Excuse me? I was doing the spinny thing. You telling me that that doesn't count? Whoa. Have you made it further than me? For now. Is that fucker following me? No, oh, he's asleep. <laughs> oh, what was this? And now you can't get it. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> now get the hell away from me. He did. You too, asshole. You caught up with him, you motherfucker. You did oh. really well, though. Really well. Damn. Hey, you're back to 40 lives. Yeah. That was because of uh, getting that star and hitting all those wigglers and stuff. That's good though. Well, don't let them touch you underneath though. Apparently that doesn't work. Oh shit. You know, I notice I'm not I'm not uh, crouching as much as I was last week. That's good. It's real good because I wasn't doing anything for you. No, <laughs> saved your life once. Once. And as soon as I as soon as it saved my life, I ended up killing myself. Okay. Uh, yeah. This is the way we want. Ooh, secret ending. Took a fish with you. Hey, a switch palace. You can do those. Sweet. Although the last one you did, you died on immediately. Did, did I really? Yeah. Just do a flashback on that one.
Yay! I'm sure these will come in handy. They will. Just like all the other Switch Palaces came in handy. Yeah. Yeah, they did. That's the last Switch Palace, too. And we're still in World 3, or are we in World 4? We're in World 5. Oh. Well. So, yeah. Forced of Illusion's a little bit of a pain, by the way, if you couldn't gather that on your own. Yeah. It's a pain in the booty. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Mm. And that barely clipped me. Thick. That sucks. Really? Yeah, a lot of stuff on the screen. A lot of moving stuff on the screen. Go, 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 go! up all the sleeping fish. You bastard. His parents never taught him that it's rude to wake up sleeping people. Especially fish. You can do one more episode and that's it for this week. Mm -hmm. I mean one more level. One more level? Holy crap. We're almost done. That's insane. Okay. Let's make it count. Um, I don't appreciate you being on bubbles. Fuck! <laughs> Let me try. Try. Because, right, like I've said before, uh, where in an area that I'm not as good in anymore. Past Castle 3. So. What the hell? He's, he's just, he's just sitting there and shocked. And there wasn't even anything in there. Ah. Uh, oh. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, this is not good. Not good. 
you just do it. Yeah. Okay. You got it. Well, that's it for this week. So have a great weekend, everybody. Now they only get one day without us. Have a great day. Or whatever you're doing. Do it well. And look what you get to start us with next week. Oh, great. A freaking haunted house. See you uh, later. I can't wait. See ya. Bye.